and welcome back to my channel. Today for you I've got something very very exciting and it's in this envelope. I haven't opened the envelope, I've just picked this up from the parcels office. I know the products that are inside but I'm yet to look at them. So I'm just going to give you a little bit of context. You may have seen my video on my eczema story and that has now got something like 20,000 views which is insane. Wow! I've had so much support on that video about my eczema story and um, I promise I will try and do a follow-up video about how my eczema is doing now and any updates because you guys keep asking. But for now, I have been contacted by a company called Chase PR and a lovely lady called Rachel was the one who contacted me and she asked whether I wanted to test out Bioderma products. Now, Bioderma is a brand that I've heard loads about. I know it's quite expensive, so it's uh, you know higher quality and their products literally cater to everyone from super dry sensitive skin to oily skin. So I am both with the eczema that targets my hands um, and I've also got quite a lot on my wrist at the moment. I just keep scratching because I'm a bit stressed. Um, and then I have oily skin on my face because I get quite a lot of blemishes. So I'm really excited to try out this range, I've heard amazing reviews and I just want to get into this package and show you what products I've been given. So the way I'm going to do this, I'm going to show you what's inside and then I'm going to run tests maybe over the next week or so um, and I'm going to kind of vlog that to give you a bit more of like a scientific experiment just to show you whether it actually works or not because it's all very well me just reviewing the packaging and um, me putting it on the back of my hand but I do actually have eczema and I do actually have difficult skin so I want to see and I want to tell you guys if these products really work because I know they are a little bit more expensive. So without further ado, let's open up the package. Okay, so I've got a lovely little note here from Rachel. T Seren, here you go, let me know how you get on, Rach. With three kisses. Thanks, Rach. Okie dokie. So, she sent me these products beforehand uh, on an email so I could look at them and tell her which products I thought would best suit my skin type. So the first one that I've picked up is the Bioderma Atoderma Gel Douche, which is the Ultra Gentle Shower Gel. Normal to dry, sensitive skin, cleanses, softens and protects. So it's paraben free and hypoallergenic, which is perfect. I use Sanex at the moment because obviously I need to make sure it's really gentle for my skin. So we chose this because I just always am on the lookout for a shower gel that's not going to dry out my hands um, and make my skin irritated. So, does it say anything on the back? Soap free foaming cleanser contains the skin protect complex with dual biological action. One, it boosts the skin moisture level by stimulating the production of hyaluronic acid. I need lots of moisture on my skin, that is good, I'm glad to hear that. And two, it lastingly protects the skin thanks to its lipid replenishing action. Its ultra gentle formula respects the skin's balance. More resistance, the skin regains softness and suppleness from the first application. Okay, so that is what I'm looking out for. I'm looking to see whether my skin, so I, you won't be able to see on the camera, but I have got this whole patch here is so dry and sore at the moment. Um, and I've got patches in between my fingers that are also very dry. So yeah, I'll see whether this actually does replenish my skin's moisture levels after the first application. I will use it in the shower tomorrow, I think. Another thing that I like to test, I just like to do the smell test. Let's open it up. <laughs> mm, it smells nice. It's very nice and fresh, very nice and natural. But this only retails for $7.99, which I don't think is a bad price for something that is so tailored to sensitive skin and I really hope that this makes a difference. The second one I've got is the Bioderma Atoderma Intensive Balm, so ultra soothing balm for very dry, irritated to atopic sensitive skin. Repairs, restores, lipids, anti-itching, which is exactly what I need because my, with my eczema being where it is on here, and with my nail, I've got quite long nails as well, it's so tempting for me to just scratch. Anywhere that's itchy, I will just scratch it. And um, when I used to have the cysts on my hands and the lumps, um, I used to pop them and then they would bleed and then I would just scratch because it was just so inflamed and irritated. So yes, yeah, something like this back then would have been a massive help, but I'm sure it'll definitely help my skin now because it's coming up to winter and that is the moment. When I start getting a bit scared because everything starts getting a lot more dry, non-perfumed as well, which is good. So I'm just gonna put it on my wrist. 
really massage that in there. It feels nice and it's definitely reduced some of the cracked skin on there, so that's always a plus. Right, let me just read what it says on the back. Right, quickly stops itching and reduces the urge to scratch thanks to its anti-itching dermatological active ingredient PEA. Enriching with soothing and purifying agents, it immediately calms irritation. So yeah, for anyone with eczema, that is absolutely perfect. Uh, the things that I've been using instead um, recently is the E45, which I always use on my whole body, and then the Dipra Base, which, is, uh, which I got prescribed to me by my doctor. So these two things are usually what I reach for. But now that I've got this, I'm going to keep this in my bag and I'm going to give this a go. So this retails for $13.49. This is the price on Feel Unique, um, but they are doing three for two at the moment. So it's a little bit more on the expensive side, but I will let you know whether this actually works any better than the E45 cream or not. Okay, so this is the first day of me trying the Bioderma cream, moisturising cream. So this is the sensitive balm and I don't know whether you can see but on my arms, let's try and go closer, it's really dry and I've got quite a lot of little dots. So, ooh, this is so risky. Oh my god, right, I'm gonna have to bend down. So I'm gonna pop some of this on my arms and see how it feels. Oh my god, you're resting so precariously right now. I think I've taken a little bit too much. I can always pop some on my legs as well because they're also very dry. I really need to get into a proper moisturising routine for my body because, like I said, it's just getting to that time of year where everything is so dry. I'm getting a few spots as well. Just rub the rest off on my legs. Okay, so this is what the skin looks like afterwards. So nice and smooth. You look all nice and shiny. It actually makes me look really tanned, which is crazy. But yeah, it's so much smoother than it was so this is just the first application so we'll let this sink in and see how long it lasts checking back in on the intensive balm and literally this still feels like i've just put it on my skin my arms you probably won't be able to see but they are still so smooth yeah my arms to touch still have that kind of sticky, dewy feeling of just putting moisturiser on, which is amazing. And yeah, a lot of the bumps have gone as well. So it's now 20 past 12 and I put this on at maybe about nine-ish. So yeah, for it to feel like I've only just applied it, that is a long, long time. That is the uh, intensive balm. Okay, the next thing I'm so excited for, this is the um, Aetoderm SOS spray. So six hour acting, um, it soothes irritated, dry and sensitive skin um, for when you're really itching. So you can just whack this out of your bag, spray it on, it'll stop you itching, which I think is so amazing. I wish I had this a year ago, honestly, this would have saved so much hassle. Especially when I was working as a waitress and I was washing my hands all the time, that was actually the worst thing. Maybe that's the reason why my eczema is so much better because I'm not washing my hands all the time in, in waitressing. Oh, it all makes sense now. <laughs> okay, anyway, so this is in a spray canister. Again, very handy. Uh, it just says, soothes itching in 60 seconds for a six hour effective, um, oh, six hour efficiency. Skin relief technology combined with the soothing dermatological active ingredients acts at the origin of the biological itching process. So again, I'm going to spray this on the patch of skin. Let me take my Fitbit off so we can get this properly. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Has no smell either, which is good. Well, that does feel cooling. I've got something on my hands as well. Well, that doesn't sting. That's one good thing. A lot of the time I can put these creams on and because the skin is actually cracked around this area, it would sting. So yeah, that's fine. 
I'm not sure whether it's going to last six hours, we shall see, but that is going to be another test. So the SOS spray retails at $7.99, and I think this is such a neat little invention. I really hope that it's worth the price. So I don't know whether you can see, but this is my wrist at the moment. It's really dry. I don't think you can get the full extent. But anyway, I'm going to use the SOS spray, because I'm getting a little bit itchy on my wrist. Can you see that a bit better? And there we go, like magic, it's completely gone. And the final thing, which I'm so excited for, is she's put in a mini um, micellar water, the mini bioderma micellar water, which I'm going to use tonight to take my makeup off. Oh my gosh, I've heard so much about this. I use the Garnier one, I've never thought to buy this one. So having it in a miniature form to test out is just, I think it's just going to be a really good experiment to see whether it's actually any better for the price point than the Garnier one. Look how tiny the bottle is, that is just so adorable. So this in 250ml is 10.99 on Feel Unique and then in the 500ml it's 15.79. And then this little bottle here retails for £5.19. So if you do want to test this out before buying the big version, it's really not too much of an investment. So um, I will obviously tell you whether I think it's better than the Garnier one, but if you do want to pick one up, it's only £5.19. Okay, so it's half six, I'm gonna get this makeup off my face because my goodness, it's been on all day. And girls, you'll be able to relate this feeling of just when you've had it on for so long, you just wanna get it off your face. So I'm going to take half of it off using the Bioderma and I'm going to take half of it off using the micellar water. So let's see which one does it better. So now I'm just going to go back over and just see which one has got off the most makeup because I did have to go over that one twice on my eye. Oh, there is still some stuff on the Bioderma side. Okay, so that's how much stuff is left on the Bioderma side. And let's look on the micellar. So that's how much was left on both of them. I had gone over the micellar water side twice, but they're pretty much the same. I don't think there's much difference in how easy it was to take off my makeup and yeah, my skin looks and feels very clean. I'm gonna do a proper cleanse as well, so don't worry about me using different pads for different things. So yeah. So it's now four days later and I just want to give you guys um, an update and just a summary of my thoughts on all of the products. So let's start with the SOS spray. I love that it's travel size, it fits in things perfectly uh, and it's so easy to take with me to uni especially if I start to get itchy and stuff maybe in a lecture I can just take this out and use it straight away. So this product is really handy. It's very soothing and it hydrates my skin pretty much instantly. It doesn't last for six hours, that's the only thing. Probably lasts for about maybe four maximum, like three to four hours, which is still really good. But yeah, it doesn't last for the full six hours, especially not on my skin where it is really dry. So that's this one. So the next product is the Intensive Balm. I absolutely love this product. It feels so moisturizing. It's really helped my dry patches on my arms. And it's also helped the dry patches here and on my hands as well. Instantly relieves any dry skin, which is amazing. Uh, and also it lasts for ages. Like I said in my testing vlog clip, I put it on and then many hours later it still felt like I just put a fresh application on. So a really hydrating, long lasting product. And in comparison to the E45 cream, I think the big difference is this feels, doesn't feel as moisturizing and it definitely does not last as long. Um, sometimes I feel that when I put this on, it just kind of sinks into my skin straight away and doesn't really do much. Whereas this sinks into my skin, but also kind of sits on there. So I know that my skin is kind of constantly being moisturized. So yeah, I definitely would reach for this more over the E45. So the next product is the gel douche, which is the shower gel. I've been using this every single day. And to be honest, it's just a really nice, gentle foaming shower gel. It's not really any different to the Sanex that I use. It is more expensive than Sanex. I can't really see much more benefit from using this to using the Sanex, but it's a lovely product and it feels so nice on my skin. 
I think using maybe a combination of all of them together has really helped. Like I said, the skin on my arms and um, the, I don't know what it's called, but I, I've had it all my life, just like these rough dots on my arms. Apparently it's quite common. So this has made that feel a lot nicer, but it also might be down to the balm. So yeah, just in terms of, you know, a sensitive, gentle, body wash for the shower. This ticks all the boxes. So finally my verdict on the Bioderma Micellar Water. I think the only difference that I felt is that this feels a lot milder, kind of when you put it on it feels softer. I don't know whether that makes any sense to anyone but it just feels a little bit kind of smoother and a little bit more luxurious on my skin but in terms of taking off my makeup it does exactly the same thing as the Garnier Micellar Water um, if anything this probably takes it off a little bit easier than the Garnier but then for a big bottle of the same product it's about three times as much so yeah there's really not that much in it um, but I will keep using this and I love that it's a travel size if I am going to purchase it again I'm going to purchase it in the miniature size and then just take it traveling with me in terms of using this product on acne prone skin which is the real test which I wanted to try uh, it hasn't broken me out and it just gives a real nice cleanse exactly the same as the micellar water really it's nice and gentle so yeah no more breakouts and that is exactly what I was looking for. So that's it for this video. If you have any comments about the Bioderma products or about eczema or my eczema story, then please leave them in the comments below. I just love reading all of your comments. If you like any of the products, I will leave links to them in the description. They're on Feel Unique, Boots and Look Fantastic. And there's also loads of three for two offers going on at the moment. So if you are a student and you're a little bit worried about the price range, then those websites will have loads of deals. And also you can just shop around that's what I do all the time I like to go to different websites to find things um, and compare prices especially when places like feel unique have a 10% student discount so every little helps I also really welcome any video ideas so also leave those in the comments if you just have anything you want me to do because I love doing videos that you guys want to watch so yeah any suggestions are very welcome leave the video a big like if you enjoyed it and if you are new to my channel then please 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 subscribe I'm so close to 2005 500 subscribers which would be amazing so yes don't forget to hit that subscribe button thank you for watching and i'll see you next time in another video bye